Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Tech Quiz Learning Point. I hope you all are doing great. I am Bashar. In my previous tutorial in this series of Azure Fundamental, I already discussed on the topic of Azure features and tools for managing and deploying resources. Today I am going to start a discussion on the topic monitoring tools in Azure. In this tutorial, you will be introduced to tools that help you monitor your environment and applications, both in Azure and in on-premises or multi-cloud environments. I can assure you all that this tutorial will make sense to you about the Azure fundamentals. The ultimate target of this tutorial is to make you prepare for the exam is it 900 microsoft azure fundamentals if anyone want to be the microsoft certified azure fundamentals this tutorial will be the right choice for them to make clear the exam is it 900 microsoft azure fundamentals this tutorial is derived from microsoft learning path for azure fundamentals exam so Anyone can rely on this tutorial to take the preparation for the exam AZ-900 Azure Fundamentals. Before starting the discussion, let's look into the contents of this tutorial. What will be discussed? This tutorial will cover tools including the purpose of Azure Advisor, Azure Service Health, Azure Monitor such as Azure Log Analytics, Azure Monitor Alerts and Application Insights that you can use to monitor your Azure environment. The exam AZ-900 Microsoft Azure Fundamentals includes three knowledge domain areas such as number one, describe cloud concepts, number two, describe Azure architecture and services, and number three, describe Azure management and governance. This tutorial is the 8th episode of the Azure Fundamentals series and it is a part of 3 knowledge domain. Azure Advisor evaluates your Azure resources and makes recommendations to help improve reliability, security and performance, achieve operational excellence and reduce cost. Azure Advisor is designed to help you save time on cloud optimization. The recommendation service includes suggested actions you can take right away, postpone or dismiss. In simply, Azure Advisor is a mechanism in which Azure resources can be evaluated. As a result of this evaluation, some recommendations are created to help improve reliability, security, and performance. On the basis of this recommendation, operational excellence is achieved and cost is reduced. The recommendations are available via the Azure portal and the API. And you can set up notifications to alert you to new recommendations. When you are in the Azure portal, the advisor dashboard displays personalized recommendations for all your subscriptions. You can filter to select recommendations for specific subscription resource groups or services. The recommendations are divided into five categories. Reliability is used to ensure and improve the continuity of your business critical applications. Security. Security is used to detect threats and vulnerabilities that might lead to security breaches. Performance. Performance is used to improve the speed of your applications. Operational excellence. Operational excellence is used to help you achieve process and workflow efficiency, resource manageability and deployment best practices. Cost. Cost is used to optimize and reduce your overall Azure spending. 
it's very important to manage your infrastructure needs reach your customers innovate and adapt rapidly but question is that how it can be managed by means of a global cloud solution which is provided by microsoft azure it can be managed this global solution is called the azure health service it could seem like a daunting task to know the status of the global azure infrastructure and your individual resources azure service health helps you keep track of as a resource both your specifically deployed resources and the overall status of azure azure service health does this by combining three different azure services azure status azure status is a broad picture of the status of azure globally azure status informs you of service outages in azure on the azure status page the page is a global view of the health of all azure services across all azure regions it's a good reference for in incidents with widespread impact service health service health provides a narrower view of azure services and regions it focuses on the azure services and regions you are using this is the best place to look for service impacting communications about outages plant maintenance activities and other health advisors because the authenticated service health experience knows which services and resources you currently use you can even set up service health alerts to notify you when service issues plant maintenance or other changes may affect the azure services and regions you use resource health resource health is a tailored view of your actual azure resources it provides information about the health of your individual cloud resources such as a specific virtual machine instance using azure monitor you can also configure alerts to notify you of availability changes to your cloud resources by using azure status service health and resource health azure service health gives you a complete view of your azure environment or the oa from global status of azure services and regions down to specific resources additionally historical alerts are stored and accessible for later review something you initially thought was a simple anomaly that turned into a trend can readily be reviewed with investigated thanks to the historical alerts Azure Monitor is a platform for collecting data on your resources, analyzing the data, visualizing the information and even acting on the results. Azure Monitor can monitor Azure resources, your on-premises resources and even multi-cloud resources like virtual machines hosted with a different cloud provider. On the left is a list of resource sources of logging and metric data that can be collected at every layer in your application architecture from application to operating system and network in the center the logging and metric data are stored in central properties repositories on the right the data is used in several ways you can view real time and historical performance across each layer of your of your architecture or aggregated and detailed information the data is displayed at different levels for different audiences 
you can view high level reports on the azure monitor dashboard or create custom views by using power bi and cost queries additionally you can use data to help you react to critical events in real time through alerts delivered to team via sms email and so on or you can use thresholds to trigger auto scaling functionality to scale to meet the demand slide 6 as you log analytics as you log analytics is the tool in the azure portal where you will write and run log queries on the data gathered by azure monitor log analytics is a robust tool that supports both simple complex queries and data analysis you can write a simple query that returns a set of records and then use features of log analytics to sort filter and analyze the records you can write an advanced query to perform a statistical analysis and visualize the results in a chart to identify a particular trend whether you work with the results of your queries interactively or use them with other azure monitor features such as log query alerts or workbooks log analytics is a tool that you are going to use to write and test those queries azure monitor alerts are automated way to stay informed when azure monitor detects a threshold big crossed you set the alert conditions the notification actions and then azure monitor alerts notice when an alert is triggered and depending on your configuration azure monitor alerts can also attempt corrective action alerts can be set up to monitor the logs and trigger on certain log events or they can be set to monitor metrics and trigger when certain metrics are crossed for example you could set a metric based alert up to notify you when the cpu uses on a virtual machine exceeded 80% alert rules based on metrics provide near real time alerts based on numeric values rules based on logs allow for complex logic across data from multiple sources azure monitor alerts use action groups to configure who to notify and what action to take an action group is simply a collection of notification and action bar preferences that you associated with one or multiple alerts azure monitor service health and azure advisor all use actions groups to notify you when an alert has been triggered application insights and azure monitor feature monitors your web applications application insight is capable of monitoring applications that are running in azure on premises in the in a different cloud environment there are two ways to configure application insights to help monitor your application you can either install an sdk in your application or you can use the application insight as an The application insights agent is supported in c sharp dot net, vb dot net, Java, JavaScript, Node dot js, and Python. Once application insight is up and running, you can use it to monitor a broad array of information such as request rates, response times, and failure rates, dependency rates. response times and failure states to show whether external services are slowing down performance page views and load performance reported by users browsers ajax calls from web pages including reads response times and failure rates user and session counts performance 
counters from Windows or Linux server machines such as CPU, memory and network users. At the last stage of this tutorial, I want to review the tutorial in terms of the following topics. Azure Advisor Azure Advisor is a mechanism in which Azure resources can be evaluated. As a result of this evaluation, some recommendations are created to help improve reliability, security and performance. On the basis of these recommendations, operational excellence is achieved and cost is reduced. Azure Service Health Azure Service Health helps you to keep track of Azure resources both Azure specifically deployed resources and overall status of Azure. Azure Monitor Azure Monitor is a platform for collecting data on your resources, analyzing that data, visualizing the information and even acting on the results. Azure Monitor can monitor Azure resources on your on-premises resources and even multi-cloud resources like virtual machines hosted with a different cloud provider. Azure Log Analytics Azure Log Analytics is the tool in the Azure portal where you will write and run log queries on the data gathered by Azure Monitor. Log Analytics is a robust tool that supports both simple complex queries and data analysis. Application Insights Application Insights is an Azure Monitor feature that monitors your web applications. Application Insights is capable of monitoring applications that are running in Azure on premises on or in a different cloud environment. Thank you for watching this tutorial. I hope you all have been able to take the idea about the monitoring tools in Azure. If you think this tutorial is helpful for learning the Azure Cloud Computing, please click on the like button and request you all to share it more and more to the persons who are searching the tutorial like this. If you have any questions on this tutorial, opinions and queries about this channel, please type this in the comment box. You also have mail to me in the description box, email id is given for you. Kindly subscribe to this channel and click on the bell button so that you can get notification when your new tutorial is published.